Hello Sagittarius, welcome to a you and them love reading. We're going to be looking at what's going on in your connection, how you feel about each other, and what's going on between you. As always, these are meant to be general love readings, so they will not resonate with every Sagittarius watching. Take what resonates for you. Check out your other placements as well. Your moon, your rising sign, any other sign of significance. I have all of the playlists linked in the description box if you want to check out those other messages. Sometimes they can resonate more. All right, let's jump right in for Sagittarius. Spirits, angels, guides. What's going on for Sagittarius? What's going on between them and the person they are thinking about connecting with at this time? What's going on for Sagittarius in love? What's going on? What's going on between Sagittarius and this other person? What's going on in their connections at this time? Page of Wands. What's going on for Sagittarius? Ace of Cups reverse. What's going on for Sagittarius and this other person in their connection at this time? Okay. Page of Wands, Ace of Cups reverse, Ten of Cups reverse. So there's been disappointment here, heartbreak. Or an emotional block could also be. Tell me about Sagittarius. Sagittarius, I'm going to have you on one side, your person on the other. Feel free to flip these energies if they resonate more for you. What's going on for Sagittarius? I just want to put down your energies and this person's energies for some reason. Ten of Wands reverse. What's going on for Sagittarius in this connection? What's going on? Three of Cups. What's going on for Sagittarius in this connection? Two of Pentacles reverse. Well, you're dropping something for sure. There's something here that you are just done with dropping. Ten of Wands reverse. Some sort of baggage, some sort of attachment. Could be related to another person you could be um kind of getting out there hanging out with your friends more with your family more celebrating something i'll have to see what that's about tell me about the person sagittarius is dealing with what do we need to know about this other person don't even think about it back there sir Tell me about this other person. Seven of Wands, Reverse, The Hangman, Four of Pentacles. Interesting. The Hangman and Four of Pentacles. I'm picturing somebody that is um, holding on. Like I'm picturing somebody that literally goes in a room, closes the door, and just holds on to something like almost in a stubborn way which is interesting because the seven of wands is reversed so this could be somebody that is fighting for something against all odds or it could be somebody that says one thing and does another because seven of wands reverse is typically someone that gives up the fight gives up no longer stands firm against the challenge hmm there's something a bit strange here so let's dig in and find out what that is. Let's find out what this heartbreak situation is about or this disappointment. Tell me about the Ace of Cups reverse and the Ten of Cups reverse. Why is the Ace of Cups reverse and the Ten of Cups reverse? Eight of Wands reverse. Something has stopped. Five of Cups reverse. Communication could have stopped. Five of Cups reverse is typically a card about recovering what's been lost so why is the eight of wands reverse see there's something I'm, I'm gonna have to figure this out tell me about the ace of cups reverse and the ten of cups reverse king of cups cancer pisces scorpio energy the devil reverse at the bottom of the deck capricorn energy the hierophant after that this could be some sort of long-term attachment here that someone could be breaking free from or it could be a long-term attachment with a lot of unhealthy dynamics. Um, typically, the devil reverse is someone that's no longer restricted, no longer making the wrong choices. 
Um, so why is the eight of wands reverse and the page of wands is here so page of wands and eight of wands reverse are complete opposites so i'm sensing a back and forth like a little tug of war tell me about the page of wands why is the page of wands here why is the page of wands here eight of pentacles someone working hard on something focus putting in Energy, tell me about the Page of Wands, creating something. Judgment. Two very different energies here. I'm sensing this, almost like these are two different people. It's like two people that are could be approaching the same problem, but very differently. What's going on here? Spirit, what's going on between Sagittarius and this other person? What's the main energy? For this connection what's the main energy for this connection the judgment card is here which is and usually when i see it with something like the eight of pentacles i think of someone working hard on maybe getting a second chance for themselves unhealthy attachment yeah there's something here with an unhealthy attachment some sort of unhealthy bond some sort of um toxicity codependency could be addictions that's affecting your connection and this is a big problem. If you're talking, uh, you know, if this is a situation where there's no unhealthy attachment, I don't think that this might be your reading. If this is not affecting you and them, it's affecting one of you enough that it's affecting your connection with each other, if that makes sense. Let's dig in a little bit more. Why is the Eight of Wands reverse? Eight of Wands reverse is typically a block. Uh, something stopped. Something no longer moving, no longer, um, he, um, there's no, there's, there's a standstill. Things are at a standstill. It's like someone hit the brakes here. And it's disappointing. The Emperor Reverse, yeah. This is somebody that doesn't have control over the situation. This is someone that might feel powerless, that might feel like they've lost their handle on the situation. The Emperor is Aries Energy. Typically, when he's reversed, he could also be very upset. But I think this is just someone that um, cannot do what they want to do. They cannot achieve their goal. Interesting, the King of Cups is here. Tell me about this King of Cups. Tell me about the King of Cups. The Hierophant, Taurus energy. So interesting. Why is the King of Swords reversed and Five of Pentacles? And then the Ace of Pentacles. So I feel like someone's out in the cold here. Maybe through deception. Maybe they did something they shouldn't have. Because the Ace of Cups is reversed. The Ten of Cups is reversed. So I feel like there was love. And it's almost like it's now ruined. And it could be because of this King of Swords reverse. Why is the eight of pentacles here with judgment typically i think of someone working on a second chance a new beginning but i don't know i feel like there might be if that is the case if someone's wanting a second chance this other person i don't think they're in the same boat or they're not as there's no success here because of this unhealthy attachment tell me about the judgment card with the eight of pentacles what's this about why is judgment here the sun the world reverse. Knight of Swords. Again with the back and forth. Someone's working on their own happiness here, but they're stuck in a cycle with the world reverse. There's a something's not closed. They're ready for something new, but something's not closed. So this it's almost like how can they move forward quickly? Knight of Swords. What is going on? <laughs> I feel like I'm missing a big part of this that's not in the cards. Um, now, one way to interpret this would be, you know, out of heartbreak and disappointment, someone's taking the initiative to try to fix this, to try to have a second chance, right? Let's say that that's what this energy is here on this side but then when you look over here 
This is someone who's trying to recover the past, but there's no movement, no action with the Eight of Wands reverse. There's no communication, perhaps. And someone doesn't have the, the courage or the control to bring back stability, even though they're a King of Cups. So it's almost like that could be the message. Could maybe due to an unhealthy attachment, right? But I feel like I'm missing something. <laughs> I feel like I'm missing something. Why is this? Why is something? This could be a third party situation. And that's probably why I'm missing something. Because they're not here. Tell me about this 10 of wands reverse. Let me jump down here to you. Maybe you'll give me a little bit more insight down here. Why is the 10 of wands reverse? Why is the 10 of wands reverse? Queen of pentacles reverse. Why is the 10 of wands reverse? Six of Swords reverse. Five of Wands reverse. Six of Wands reverse. Oh my gosh, this is not good. Whatever this is, it's not. It's almost like it's tainted. If Six of Swords reverse is someone returning, you don't want them. If you are trying to leave a situation um, because you want to like get over the conflict, overcome this the situation that's not moving forward, move on with your life. For some reason, there's delays there. Tell me more about Sagittarius. Tell me more about Sagittarius and the energy they're bringing to this connection. Balancing act. I feel like you were po probably doing a lot in this connection or feeling like you were being pulled in a bunch of directions. Maybe you went back and forth about, I don't know, how you really felt about this past life patiently waiting at the bottom of the deck yeah taking action paralyzing fear i feel like you were waiting for someone to take action someone from your past or someone from a past life um and i feel like you were just stuck in this rut i feel like you were maybe putting in more than you were receiving and i think you dropped that because the two of pentacles is reversed and the ten of wands is reversed i feel like you want to move on here tell me about the two of pentacles reverse Tell me about the two of pentacles reverse. Wow, two of cups. Yeah, it's hard though because I think that you have strong feelings for this person or this connection is extremely strong. Yeah, but yeah, again, there's an attachment here, I feel. But it's 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 weird. Um the magician reverse, ace of pentacles, knight of swords. I feel like this is a situation where you just don't know what to do about this person or this situation anymore. You know that it can't, you can't stay where you are, but you don't know where to go. Um, or you know that this can't be it for you because this is not acceptable. But then at the same time, are you ready to give it all up? I feel like there's a back and forth going on. What's this three of cups about? Why is the three of cups here? What can you tell me about this three of cups? Queen of Wands reverse. I think this is a third person. I think there's someone that could be in the way here that is interrupting things. It does not have to be a romantic partner. Yeah, Strength reverse, Queen of Wands reverse. Um, Leo energy, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius energy. Um, I think this could be you as well, um, just being unhappy. But they have the Ten of Pentacles at the bottom of the deck. So I think there's something in the way here. And it's... Uh, how do I even explain this? Because I'm getting so many messages. I feel like for a lot of Sagittarius, um, there's a lot going on in your mind right now. I feel like there's a lot going on in your head about this situation. Um, you might be feeling confused and it's showing up here because I, I, I'm getting this sense almost like you want to give up a burden because you haven't received what you deserve. But can you truly leave this behind? I don't know. And then the Three of Cups here with the Queen of Wands reverse. It's almost like someone's upset. Someone here could be acting out. This could be a third person. This could be you upset, you know, and Strength reverse. It's almost like somebody cannot control the situation. And so they get upset. So that's why I don't want to say this is the third, per the third person. Or the interference because this could be you upset at the fact that things can't improve that you can, that you don't have control over what happens here and that could be frustrating for you maybe you're just over it 
Some of you are dealing with a person who's already married or in a fi family dynamic that's very unhealthy. And this is keeping you from the success that you desire. Six of Wands, Nine of Cups, Reverse, Ten of Pentacles. And then with the Nine of Pentacles Reverse here, this could also be a symbol for your person being attached, dependent on someone else, right? Not free, not independent. But I'm also seeing this as you being attached to this connection because of the strength of the connection. And so it's like this back and forth, back and forth. Maybe you're finally making a decision about this. No more, right? I don't want to keep doing this, you know, because this is this this has been very heartbreaking and disappointing. This is, hasn't been love and rainbows and butterflies all the way. There's a lot of conflict here, obstacles here. Let's look at your person. Why is the hangman here? Now the hangman is starting to make sense. Because I feel like your person is the one that's stuck. Why is the hangman here? The empress? Wow, the emperor and the empress on the board. But the emperor's reverse. The empress is upright, which tells me they're not on the same page. Tell me about the hangman. Oh my God. What is going on? The chariot. Reverse. Cancer energy. Very similar to the eight of wands reverse. So your person is literally stuck. They're not moving. They're not taking action. They probably don't even know where they're headed or if they were to take action. What's this four of pentacles about? Why is the four of pentacles here? Wow, the tower. This person doesn't want a tower to happen, but it's going to happen in their life. I feel like this person is kind of stubbornly holding on or stubbornly holding back. And this tower is going to force them. It's going to force their hand, I feel. Wow, the magician reversed. Yikes. And then the nine of wands at the bottom of the deck with the wheel of fortune. So it's like divinely guided dis, uh, pain and, and, and struggle. Things are going to be shifting for this person. Now, maybe this is helping them out of a hole or out of a, a difficult situation if they're the ones in an unhealthy attachment, which I feel like they most likely are. And it could be a marriage because I have the higher font here. The Ten of Pentacles came out. Ten of Cups reverse. Sometimes that could be like a family unit. Tell me about this person that Sagittarius is dealing with or thinking about. Tell me about this person. Parting ways, restoring balance. Okay, again with the same old. So this person is probably trying to fix a separation or restore balance despite a difficulty, despite the heartbreak, despite the divide. Let me get one more. Tell me more for this person. This person that Sagittarius is dealing with. Or thinking about what do we need to know about this person what do we need to know if I get courthouse I might scream because I keep getting it okay concern despair why is it oh my deck is reversed concern and despair yeah um, that's my whole deck was reversed so, it's, so okay concern and despair yeah this person's not dealing well with the situation that they're in because they're in an unhealthy situation, a toxic situation, a difficult situation. Um, I also feel like this person's like worried about something. Maybe worried about this looming tower. Worried about the fact that they're stuck. Because this person, make no mistake, they are stuck. They're not moving. They're not taking action. This person is, is almost rigid. Frozen. Tell me more about this person. What do we need to know? I'm starting to understand our connection. Bottom of the deck, I am afraid to contact you. Okay, well, that's, are you guys not in contact? Is that what's going on? Is that why the Eight of Wands is reverse? This person's worried about something. So what I'm getting here, Sagittarius, is that this person's most likely dealing with a situation outside of you this could be somebody that for whatever reason is apart from you because of their the bs that they're dealing with but that doesn't change the outcome you know it, it still means that that sucks for you 
um, as delicate as I am putting that, you know, that's just how, how it is. I feel like, okay, I can feel bad for this person. They're dealing with an unhealthy attachment. They're dealing with something difficult, right? And that sucks for them. But they're almost like keeping you waiting or they're keeping you have hope for some reason or you you're not able to close this chapter there's some it's almost like they're being stuck is making you stuck but i think you're not interested in that or that's not what you want i feel like you want to be free of this whole situation ten of wands reverse two of pentacles reverse um, let me get one more for you. Can I get one more energy for Sagittarius? Can I get one more energy, please? For Sagittarius, can I get one more energy? Yeah, new beginnings. Exactly. Some of you are like thinking about what else is out there for you. Did you have a reading like this before? Yeah, you did. The November you and them. And you're tired. Maybe you're tired of waiting. Or maybe you're tired of giving this person chances. Or maybe you're just running out of belief. You know, it's like whatever this person says, whenever they do speak, um, maybe it's not what you need to hear. Or maybe it's not enough. You know, and, and this unhealthy attachment is almost like this person could be dealing with it, but they're more concerned about this tower than they are about the fact that they're in this situation that's kind of what i'm picking up here which is which is a shame because i think this person has a lot of love or care for you with the king of cups and they are being affected by this it's not like they're trying to avoid this tower because they're happy there there's something else they're miserable this person and I have a feeling too, this restoring balance and I'm starting to understand their connection is almost like they're starting to get it. They're starting to understand why they're in this situation and why you were put in their life. But I think just as they're trying to understand this, you're already ready to go or ready to have something new. You want to be happy. You don't want it, you know, and, and I'm almost hearing this, um, I heard m several messages, but the theme was, it shouldn't be so hard. You don't understand why you always end up here or you're always, you know, deep down sad about the situation or there's more bad than good. That's kind of where your mindset here. Hmm. Okay. Let me get one more oracle. I wasn't going to, but I'm just going to do it. Because I was like, this is already long enough, but I just feel like picking one more. Spirit, can I get one more message for Sagittarius regarding their energies and this other person's energies? Tell me about Sagittarius. Yep, the phoenix. That's exactly where you are at. Literally, you're ready to just have a transformation ready to burn it all up you know <laughs> ready to be done and start a new cycle uh be born again essentially is the phoenix tell me about this person this person that sagittarius is dealing with the whale yeah a lot of emotions but i feel like they're hidden deep i think this person is probably learning a lot right now in this cycle maybe they're maturing in this cycle this person could also be older um, but what I'm getting here is someone that is doing a lot of thinking on their own. And also they could be suppressing a lot or keeping hidden uh, feelings, even though they're deep feelings, they're not very, um, they're not really expressing them. Yeah, this person has a lot going on in their life, a lot going on in their life. I think they're, they're just trying to keep their head above water, this person. But if that's the case, then maybe it's just not the right time or perhaps they need to step up to the plate and do what needs to be done for this cycle to be over because make no mistake i feel like this could be a karmic situation that they're supposed to learn from but they're not maybe they'll get there but that's not fair to you to keep you waiting so that's what i have for you now thank you so much for watching 
I hope you enjoyed the reading. Hit the like button and subscribe if you enjoyed the reading and want to see more. And I'll see you all in another video very soon. Take care.